Hello everyone. Hi again. My name is Wanda Ka. I am a third year student. I wanna just talk about training here. But I was saying it was happening. I was a bit off track. You're one out. Am I right? So I heard about the program and doing that mission now. About social media center for learning. So I enrolled and we started the program. By the time I was done, actually in my mind the possibilities of social media and the extent of information is very interesting. So I became older a bit and I mean I had a phone in my hands and people out there and so much information coming to me. But I'm always on my phone, I'm about I'm always curious to know more like about looking for information. And I have friends that have the program they want to do, things they want to market, and you know, life they want to share. I started by not my program, I just started casually posting people stuff online. There was a moment people were always ashamed of posting pictures. It's a thing, you know. People were always ashamed of helping someone post their stuff. So I just started doing it, and over time, it started happening. Many people would come to me, hey, whatever, let me post my stuff. So I'm not even getting paid for it. I'm just happy to share. So over time, I, at a point, I became a bit more popular. Business aspect, you know, I start to take commendations and stuff, and people are coming, offering me money to do their stuff. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, they are not feeling like you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, yeah, that is like just social media and that. And I wanted to do more, I wanted to sharpen my skills more. I went into graphics by myself and started learning it. And I will learn it and post it. I was bored. And it's happening. And over time, you know, getting more clients, they are bigger being and stuff. People yeah. are getting more popular. And today, it's been a journey, and which I'm proud of how far I've come. And it's in social media and promotion. So people they say, yeah, I'll tell you about promoter, yes. Because not like expecting it, but it's been a passion and it's been a process. And I'm thankful. I'm happy to be here with you, with everyone. So we have to thank all our reasons like my team. <laughs> How I met them is true, the same time, but you know, coming to lose myself. <laughs> so thank you so much. When they say you need to know how you are posting things about people, how the person that came to mind when you were talking was Expander. I don't know how he's pronounced it very well. Yeah. 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 Being intentional about what you post, it might seem like it's what you're arguing, but every person is right in their own sense. For what she's doing, you can post anything business minded. Actually, it's not just anything, it's actually intentional. Mm -hmm. And in your own case, I think I, I also align with you because someone like me, I know that before you say anything on my post, on my social media page, just know that I thought about it. And then even, even recently, I stopped retweeting anything I see on Twitter. They said, well, just let me do the one I tweet so that anything that would want me to be uh, retweeting that stuff, I would know that it's something I really value. Because it's something that you can just, wow, you know, ha ha ha, you don't retweet immediately without knowing. So it all makes sense. Every person, like our call of the difference, every person has their own aspects. Now, all these things, it really matters. Having a social platform, taking advantage of it, telling our story, communicating right and everything. But now, really, it's Back to age. The advantage is it, it gives us as, as youth is this. For the Nigerian women now, 
the, 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 at the end of the job, there is no work. It's actually true when you think of the fact that the older ones are actually taking all these pieces. We know the first time, we know they hide the truth. So let's say the truth as it is. The older ones are taking the positions that we are meant to be replacing them with. For some reason, some of them cannot even be promoted, so they remain there and they don't want to leave. So this is uh, you don't see space. And some of them, even when they reach the maximum, they reduce their age. Yeah, they that That's the thing. Now what, how social media helps you to break that age barrier is this. It's about you finding your own voice. Don't be saying you can't become a fan friend. Uh, every person just say me, it's like, oh, yeah, exactly, then there's a way you do your thing, it's feel like you're just making noise, but if you, if, if you are connected with what you're doing, you find out that you stand out from the crowd, people get to hear you, hear your story, and make you valuable. You don't tell people that you are valuable, you show people that you are valuable, let them be the ones that will perceive that, and it's through your work, the way you do your things, your work could be actually you just telling your story. Your work could actually be you just doing that work as in work or wherever you're working, but giving your best while at it. So if you can use your social media platform, you find your voice and you get access to these opportunities. Getting access is one thing, and then moving ahead is another thing. Yes, you learned that relationship will come tired of them saying when they get it right. <laughs> but if you have a voice, if you stand out, you know you're right, you keep learning. In some cases, for you to learn more, you might go volunteer more, even when it's not so favorable for you, but that's the way you learn. Yes, you keep learning. And that's extra knowledge, I mean, it is the advantage you have. 